Now we are going to do three digit addition with the regrouping method. So look at this. The first one is step one. So this is ones and this is ten and this is hundred. So three digit. Ones, tens, hundred. Ones, tens, hundred. Okay. So I am going to add the step one. That means addition. So step one, add the ones. First we have to look at the numbers. This is three digit number. The first number is a three digit number and second number is also a three digit number. So we are going to add first we have to write the place values that means ones, tens and hundred. Then we have to write the number according to the place value. Then we have to focus the what ones place. Add the ones you have to write the heading. So seven plus six you can get what thirteen ones. That is seven plus six what thirteen. How could you say it is thirteen ones? You have to add you know that add in mind already know that. So seven in the mind and six in the finger after seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen. So thirteen ones I've written. So thirteen ones is split into what one ten and three ones. So I have taken only the three ones. So three ones. So I have written the three here. The carry over is go to the what ones place. That is called as step one. So step one is over. I think you understand. Now I am going to do the step two. That is add the tens. So you have to write the three as it is in the ones place. That is thirteen ones. So I have written only the three ones. And the one ten is go to the what carry over. That is called as carry over. Carry over is go to the tens place. So now I am going to add only the tens. So two plus one three. Three plus five what eight. So one plus two plus five. One plus two plus five. I have written everything. So what is the number eight tens? So I have written eight. I have to highlight the what place values. That is what I have given in red color. So eight. So that is called as eight tens. There is no carry over. Just write the eight here. So this is step two is over. Now I move on to the step three. So this is also what addition. This is also addition. So again hundred tens and ones. I have written the a uh, number according to the place value now i'm going to concentrate only the step 3 add the hundreds so 3 plus 2 because there is no carry over i have written the ones on un ones place value answer and tens place answer i have written so there is no carry over i just add only the hundreds so 3 plus 2 3 plus 2 we can get what 5 3 in the mind 2 in the finger after 3 4 and 5 that is what i've written so five i want to highlight the what hundreds place value that is what i have given in red color so now the answer is 583 so 100 place 5 hundreds and 8 tens and 3 ones that means 583 that is the right answer for the question this is a regrouping method so regrouping method means first i have to add the ones next i have to add the step one add the ones step two add the tens And step three had the hundreds, and final answer is 583. So it's a normal addition. Also, I'll teach you no issues. This is a normal addition. So 327 and 256. So I just add. So this is a normal addition. So first I have to concentrate one space. Seven in the mind, six in the finger. After seven, what? Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So three. I have written three here. The carry over go to the carry over go to the tens place. So one plus two three three plus five what three in the mind and five in the finger after three four five six seven eight. So eight. I have written eight. So there is no carry over. I just what concentrate only in hundreds. Now I am going to add the hundreds. So three in the mind two in the finger after three four and five. So five. The answer is five hundred and eighty three. So. these two answer this is without regrouping method as a normal addition this is a regrouping method so regrouping method it's a very what of course it's a long process you have to write each and every time but without any mistake you can do it very clearly in your early age you can do this method if you take this method you can what add the addition without any mistakes and uh, you can confidently get the marks but this is a normal addition So it's a very traditional method. So it is also I've taught you, which is your favorite. You can choose any one method from this. So the answer is 583. In both method, you can get the same answer.